Well, a very, very warm welcome to you on what is, of course, a truly special day in this part of the world. It is Derby Day. A rivalry so deeply entrenched into the history of sport in this land. It divides opinions, it divides families, it divides just about anything that can be divided. The game itself lasts just 90 minutes, but its repercussions can be felt for months and years ahead. The Emirates Stadium in all its glorious modernity, this symbol of new Arsenal, the Arsenal of the 21st century. It's a friendly in theory, but we are expecting this to be fiercely contested. Well, in games of this nature, as a player, Peter, you only want to work as hard as demanded. You don't want to have to go at it full pelt. But when the opposition is what it is, all of that kind of goes out the window. The challenge here will ask more of you, and so both teams will, will wish to, to give more than they take. It's one of those games, Peter, where if the opposition increase their effort, you have to follow it. So we're up and running. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Yeah, Bernd Leno. I think his presence might make all the difference for this team. He's got lightning fast reactions and uh, a coolness under pressure that allows him to make the big one on one saves. He's also very reliable under the high ball or when he's dealing with crosses. And I'd expect the whole defense to play with a bit more assurance with him in place. Yes, getting the best out of him will count for so much. There are a few waiting for it. And he's been booked for simulation. Correctly so, Peter. It's an element of the game we just can do without. Granit Xhaka. Away from immediate danger. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. Pulisic. And he heaves it forward. Short, sure, he's gone for it. And it's a goal! It's hardly a surprise, is it? That's what we're here for. A player with this wonderful knack of being able to show up and deliver at important times. Yet, yet another example. Oh, what a cracking goal, but a cracking touch as well. That's what made it for me. That's brilliant play all round. Doubt very much that this was in the script. Tierney gets a good foot in there. And it's Zayek. Arsenal have pushed both fullbacks into. Well, that's clear cut. It's a free kick. moment you felt that was going somewhere but they'll have to go again holding Granit Xhaka Xhaka drives it forward hardly anything between the sides and it's 1-0 
And the counter is on. Ball's out on the left now. They get a throw in. Pulisic. It's cut loose. In by... Gets up to head it! And he's straight offside. Keeper sends it forward. As Pliqueta does well there. Alert. Pulisic. Werner. The Lacazette. Promising move that. Good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Be a throw. Pulisic. Struck first time. Oh, that is asking for trouble. That's gone a long way up and away. Speculative strike. To Barry. Hostel moving about it patiently, perhaps too patiently. And here's the chance to counter. Pulisic! Oh, that's a terrific save from the keeper. Pulisic really must have felt he had the measure of the keeper then, but how wrong he was. Elmeni plays it out to the flank. Gets away from his opponents. He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. Long ball, but not especially accurate. That's a ball kick. the ball that's a foul and he is going into that little black book it's a bummy and many and here's William Driving on, he could shoot here. William has got himself a free kick. William! A brilliant goal! Sumptuous finish, an absolute joy. Arsenal are level. Dispatched expertly, nicely done. That has certainly made things interesting. Oh, look, Peter, I was on the fence before a ball was kicked, and uh, I still haven't moved. Forward it goes. As Pliqueta battles to win it back. Kovacic is the guilty party there has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket it's just a stern lecture Kepa is there to take has a look and has a go Lacazette and here's William Laid out to the right. Crunching tackle. That's pretty clear. It is a foul. Chilwell gets his final warning. Well, I think the referee 
would have told him to rein it in or, or suffer the consequences. William wants to play it back. They're looking at the referee, but he's waved play on. There's the half-time whistle. So, a very watchable game so far. Action at both ends and the team's level. It's been a really interesting game up to now, and the sides are predictably very well matched. Hoping perhaps for a little bit more from both parties in the second half, but as it stands, it's one each. We're just back from your break, you've missed very little of the resumption of the second half. He spotted the run, it's William! Fine stop from the keeper. William is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. William with the short one. Shoots! Goal! And that has only enhanced his already huge reputation. Obviously hoping for an early second half boost, but there are a few who can truly make it happen, and this is a very welcome tonic. Well, look, that first touch and finish is the difference between good players and great players. There aren't too many about who can give you that. I loved it. So we have a breakthrough. Now, how will things develop from here? Yeah, for me, this team seems to find it easier to attack than defend. But now they're going to need to dig in at the back a bit. And here's Aubameyang. Shapes to shoot. Aubameyang clearly became one-eyed then. He just decided to force it. And then he. William. Great strength. Too strong for his opponent. Pulisic, Hector Bellerin, Nani, and it's Lacazette. Kovacic gets it back. Kovacic concedes a free kick for that. Well, that's the first attempt, Peter. We've seen at one of those raking passes just to spread the play holding William desperately wants to get on the end of this he's brushed off the ball there yeah, he's fouled him there Zayek, Raspilicueta, Raspilicueta goes on an adventurous run, and the finish, they've done it, they have done it, they have their equaliser, perfect timing, perfect connection, and a perfect outcome. I'll tell you, Peter, more went into that than you think. He had to anticipate the cross, get in the right position, and then time the volley. So all square and not for the first time. Yeah, for me, both sides are strong and well-matched, and I think you need to be a good player to be out there right now. It's all a little short of forward momentum, lacking thrust. Aubameyang really got caught in a trap there and he just couldn't get out. Raspilicueta hoists it forward. And a mixture of good defending and indecisive passing. No progress. Werner. Werner. defense can get it clear Chelsea have it back and they can go again
Granit Xhaka for Lacazette. Tierney, Tierney goes looking. Gets the better of his man. Tierney plays it out wide and in space. Chilwell plays it forward. Looking to break out here. Tries to get it forward quickly. And that's been levered clear. Chelsea showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. Played forward. Arsenal merit full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. Werner. That's really nice. Now, what next? Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. And the whistle's gone, presumably for offside. Leno sends that a long way. And it's Hector Bellerin. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Well, they can break here. He's picked him out. Werner tries a shot. Oh, what about that? And that may just do it. Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Turn the game on its head. Now can they hold out? Well, the last moments now, Peter, are going to be very frantic. There's still time for a, a twist or two yet. Hoist it forward. Granit Xhaka. Chelsea need to hold on for a few more moments. Could move up a gear here. Pulisic. That's a pop! In it goes! Two up now, and they are cruising. Just so calm under pressure. Pulisic really showed good strength there. Held his man off, didn't let himself get bullied, and got his effort away. Maintained control. Chelsea could not have picked a better time to snatch a two-goal lead. Is there still time for a response? Well, some fans are already on their way out, so that to me says everything, Peter. Forward it goes. I think that's offside. Yes, it is. Arsenal can't seem to retain possession. And that is it. The referee has seen enough. What a match. What a comeback. That is how to respond to adversity. Truly deserving winners. So there it is.